polyester ostomy, applying a two-piece pouching system. Collect supplies, gather pouch, skin barrier, disposal bag, tissue, and or cloth for cleaning and water. Optional scissors, pen, measuring guide, and or accessories. Remove used pouching system. Carefully lift an edge of the adhesive and peel downward, gently pushing the skin away from the skin barrier. Properly dispose of the used pouch and skin barrier. Do not flush down the toilet. Clean the skin with water or with gentle soap per orders. Rinse and dry thoroughly. Do not use oils, powder, lotion, or lotion type soaps on the skin. These products may interfere with adhesion of the skin barrier. Check to make sure the skin around the stoma is intact without irritation, rash, or redness. Consult a WC nurse as needed for peristomal skin complications and management recommendations. Measure the stoma using a stoma measuring guide before every barrier application. If using a pre-sized barrier opening, go to step seven. Trace the determined barrier size opening onto the skin barrier. The skin barrier should fit where the skin and stoma meet. Using small curved scissors, carefully cut an opening in the skin barrier to match the pattern. Do not cut beyond the line of the release liner. Verify that no skin is showing between the skin barrier and the stoma to help prevent leakage and skin irritation. Remove the release liner from the barrier. If appropriate, apply a barrier ring or thin bead of paste around the opening following the instructions for use. Apply the new pouching system. Center the skin barrier opening over the stoma in a diamond shape. For tape border barriers, remove the backing paper on both sides and press adhesive against the skin. Apply gentle pressure to the skin barrier for about a minute for best adhesion. Attach the pouch to the skin barrier by engaging the lower edges of the pouch flange and the skin barrier flange. Press the two flanges together. A series of clicks will confirm you are doing it correctly. No more clicks means the pouch is secured. If using a drainable pouch, close the lock and roll micro seal closure at the bottom of the pouch. Or apply a pouch clamp. If using a urostomy pouch, Make sure the drain valve is closed. The teardrop on the drain valve should face the body side of the pouch. If desired, apply the cap provided in the box. Thank you for watching.